Welcome Cuyahoga Falls High School class of 2025. My name is Miss Bodden and I am her principal. I work with a talented group of administrators that include Associate Principal Mr. Smith, Associate Principal Mr. DeFrancisco, and Associate Principal who currently serves as our Black Tiger Remote Learning Academy Principal, Mr. Sloan. You will hear from them later in this presentation along with Mr. Johnson, Athletic Director and Activities Director. We are beyond excited to welcome you to the Black Tiger family. When you enter the high school, you will feel the Black Tiger pride that runs through our veins and will soon run through yours. The entire staff and student body embrace four practices as part of our Black Tiger pride philosophy, namely being respectful, taking responsibility, practicing safety, and the desire to persevere. Our commitment to you over these next four years centers on creating rigorous and relevant work, building relationships among you and staff that capitalize on your unique strengths and interests, and ensuring that you achieve success both in and out of school. As you watch our presentation, I need you to jot any questions down that you may have. We are here to help you and we'll have plenty of opportunities for you to work through any concerns prior to walking through our doors this coming August. Hi Black Tiger family, my name is Rob Sloan and I'm the principal of the Black Tiger Remote Learning Academy or the BTRLA. The Cuyahoga Falls City School District created the BTRLA last year out of necessity, but it's here to stay. We have found a definite need for this learning platform and we see it as a big part of our future moving forward. Some of the BTRLA facts are as follows. All students in the BTRLA will learn at a home via an updated 100% remote learning experience. Cuyahoga Falls High School teachers and administrators will oversee the program with face-to-face -face time each day. The curriculum will meet the same standards as the CFHS curriculum and the state of Ohio. Students will be aided by the use of a supplemental online curriculum, either at Menem or Apex, for the basis of instruction and or intervention. 100% online learning option for families who prefer a virtual education is possible. An official attendance policy will be shared and communicated prior to the beginning of school. Students who are eligible for special education and related services will still receive them virtually. Students who are eligible for EL or gifted services can still receive those virtually. You will receive a comprehensive list of courses that are available along with the opportunity to still participate in many of our unified arts classes, i.e. band. Students may still participate in CCP courses that will go through the universities. And lastly, the BTRLA students will still participate in extracurricular activities as long as they meet the eligibility requirements. Regardless of what learning platform you choose for next year, we're all excited to have you part of the Black Tiger family. Go Black Tigers! Welcome class of 2025. My name is Mr. Nauer. I'm a school counselor here at the high school, coming to you today with some information regarding scheduling and your pathway through high school. At the end of your senior year, Cuyahoga Falls, as a graduate, we'd like you to become um, employed, enrolled, or enlisted. These are the three E's you'll hear about here as you come through your four years. Um, enrolled at a community college, university, or trade school, employed, become part of the workforce, or enlisted in one of our six branches of the U.S. military. So keep those in mind, don't have to make a decision now, but keep those in mind as you are you know, traveling your pathway through high school and looking at those three E's towards graduation. High school counselors are assigned by alphabet. So if your last name is A through D, your school counselor is Miss Vicki Davis. Um, students with last names E through K, Miss Cindy Hardy. Mr. Stewart with students last names L through R, and myself, I'm working with students with last names S through Z. I'd like to take a minute to talk about your graduation requirements here at the high school. All students from, from their freshman through senior year will need four units of language arts, four units of math, three units of science, three units of social studies, a half a credit of health, half a credit of PE, physical education, six electives, and one fine art credit, which will total you to a total of 21 credits needed for graduation from here at the high school. Yeah. Everyone's favorite topic, uh, state testing, graduation requirements, they are ever-changing. At this time and place, you must earn two seals. The seals are distinguished by the ODE, Ohio Department of Education. You will get more information with requirements with these seals as you move through your high school career. For any more information, you can log on to our district website. On the left-hand side, you will uh, there will be school counseling department. All of our contact information is listed there. Any information that you may need, please don't hesitate to reach out to us at any time. Good luck to the graduation class of 2025. We look forward to seeing you next year.
Welcome incoming freshmen. I'm Mr. DeFrancisco, Associate Principal for students L through Z at the high school. I'm here to talk about the student handbook and our experiences that you might be able to partake in while you're attending Coggle Falls High School. We're going to talk to you about the handbook, the new three R's, rights, responsibilities, and ramifications. This handbook is intended to serve as a guide to help students and families come to know Coggle Falls High School's programs and opportunities as well as set forth basic expectations and agreements. Please take the time to familiarize yourself with the contents. We are hopeful that the handbook will answer many questions you may have about academics, security, discipline, school rules, safety, athletics, and other topics. Please understand that no set of rules or guidelines can cover any conceivable situation that might arise at a school. The rules, policy, and procedures set forth in this handbook are intended to apply under normal circumstances. However, from time to time, there may be situations that require immediate or non-standard responses. This handbook does not limit the authority of Coggle Falls High School to deviate from the normal rules and procedures set forth in this handbook and to deal with individual circumstances that they arise in a manner deemed most appropriate by the school taking into consideration the best interests of the school, its faculty, employees, students, or overall school community. The policies may also be revised or updated periodically, even during the school year. You will be advised of any changes as they are made either electronically, email, or by mail. Any student or parent with question about any handbook policy or statement should feel free to speak with an administrative principal or the associate principals. Now I'll talk about some fun things that might occur while you're attending Coggle Falls High School that we try to have our students engage in. Our Veterans Day Memorial Flag Ceremony, Mock Trials and CFHS Courts, Haven Arrest, attending Akron and Cleveland Zoo, Great Lakes Science Center, our connection with the Akron Rubber Ducks Organization, MAPS Museum, the Cleveland Aquarium, Coggle Valley National Parks, Western Reserve Hospital, Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, the Weather Vane Theater and Playhouse Square, Cleveland Botanical Garden, Natural History Museum, Akron Art Museum, as well as the Cleveland Museum of Art, and also college visits to further your educational career, Kent State University, University of Akron, Case Western Reserve, and Stark State. Thank you, and I hope you take the time to read this information and look it over and enjoy your four years at Coggle Falls High School. And, as always, go Black Tigers! Hello, my name is Jason Smith. I'm one of the associate principals as well as the career technical education director here at Coggle Falls High School. I wanted to take a brief moment to talk to you about the opportunities that the 6th District Educational Compact has to offer for our students. The 6th District Educational Compact is comprised of six school districts which include Kent, Talmadge, Hudson, Woodridge, Stowe, and naturally Cuyahoga Falls. They provide career technical education programs for all students within these six school districts. During your sophomore year here at Cuyahoga Falls High School, you'll have an opportunity to apply for one of the 27 programs that are offered through the 6th District Educational Compact. Seven of these programs are housed right here in Cuyahoga Falls High School. I encourage you to visit our Career Technical Education website, linked in this presentation, and also linked on the high school webpage to learn more about the, our career programs here at the high school, which include Automotive Technologies, the Academy of Medical and Business Office Management, Cosmetology, Criminal Justice, Interactive Marketing and Design, the IT Academy, and our new program set to open this fall, Modern Communications through Media Productions. I encourage you to view all 27 programs offered through the 6th District Educational Compact by visiting their website at 6thDistrict.com, which is also linked in this presentation. We look forward to seeing you here in the fall as you start your high school career. Thank you, and as always, Go Black Tigers! Hi, my name is Kenny Johnson, Athletic Director and Activities Director here at Coggle Falls High School. Uh, here to give you some information on both athletics and activities. Currently we have over 30 uh, activities in our school. We have over 25 athletic teams that you can choose from um, at all different levels, freshman, junior varsity, and varsity levels. We ask that you get involved in as many activities or athletics as possible. It's a great way to meet new people, great way to get involved. Along with activities and athletics, there are eligibility requirements. As an eighth grader, your fourth quarter grades will follow you to the high school. To be eligible for athletics and activities, you must carry a 2.0 GPA 
and also pass at least five one credit course classes. Fall eligibility is determined by the fourth quarter grade, so if you want to be eligible, you must do well the fourth quarter of your eighth grade year. If you want to get involved, please fill out the Google form that is attached to this slide. We ask that all of you get involved. The more you get involved in activities and athletics, like I said before, the more people you'll meet, the more fun you'll have. We ask that you get involved, get involved early, and we look forward to seeing you next year. Thank you. I am sure you found this presentation helpful as you begin your journey planning for the next four years. It is so important to finish your eighth grade year strong, enjoying the next couple months of middle school. As far as next steps, I hope you paid close attention to Mr. Now, our school counselor, as it is very important to make sure that you follow their advice and timelines. We will also be hosting live Q&As on the dates listed both during the day and in the evening to support you and address any and all of your concerns. Your first day of school is August 18th, and this day is dedicated to freshmen only. It is a day for you to become acquainted with your classes, meet your teachers, obtain your schedules, and participate in activities created by our student leaders and Tiger crew. Personally, I can't wait to meet each of you. Believe me, four years will fly by. There were so many people that made this video orientation happen. Too many to list, but I want to make sure that they know how appreciative I am that they took time to work on our very first orientation video. A very special thank you needs to go to our videographer, editor, and producer, Mr. Lucas Fry. See you soon, class of 2025, and as always, go Black Tigers.